Greetings, my friends. I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues using the sub mod Sweet Home California, in which we are playing as a tried and true, relatively well known faction in Fallout. And that is the beautiful Western Brotherhood. But, but like normal custom game rules, I have no idea what's going to happen, and I like it that way. I like. Surprises sometimes with historical AI focuses off, but the mods we're using is Old World Blues, obviously. Sweet Home California, colored buttons, colored events, stage transfer tool mod, and player led peace conferences, the normal assortment uh, that I normally use. If you guys have suggestions for other mods, please let me know in the comments below. But let us begin, and we have an army. Let's see, we got some uh, infantry and some power armor, and they shall be led by Head Paladin Cannon. That looks like a really awesome portrait, not gonna lie. Cool, uh, pretty normal stuff. Let's get grab. A leader for the infantry, Leonardo sounds like a really cool guy. And then we shall grab Miller, Houston. Ooh, I'm gonna go with Houston. He's got a little bit more attack out of these other two. So, all right, let's do our first focus: collapse of unity. For in about a week, in 2161, the Brotherhood of Steel face its biggest threat: the super mutant armies led by the Master. Cool. And in the meantime, uh, actually, before we do that, uh, let's see. We can ha we are fielding 15 and are allowed 60 special forces battalion. So not bad. So let's go over here. So Brotherhood Knights, we have about... That's not bad. That's not bad. That's on the way to becoming 20 combat with. We're gonna make some of these. That'd be kind of cool. We're don't... Where we're going, we don't need Spec Ops soldiers. No, 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 no. We'll make some infantry too, though, at the same time. We'll probably make two infantry for every one thing of power armor, so we'll keep it like that. Set to low, set to high. Militia, not really necessary. Yeah, we won't use them. Cool. But you know what I love about the Brotherhood? We are advanced, and we have five whole research slots. Ah, very nice. And hopefully this campaign will be quite enjoyable, at least in my opinion. Construction basics? Yes, please. We're gonna immediately going to go ahead and do some improvised tools. Very nice. And we're going to also grab some work as needed. Yeah, I was considering doing the other one right now, just because I almost never do work assignments, but it's not nearly as good. Uh, yeah, I don't like less growth, actually. Actually, you get, you, get, you get a lot less growth. Holy cow. That growth is almost stagnant. Yeah, why would you want penalties anyways? Regardless, let's grab some civilian workshops because those are always good to do. 40%? Oh, no, but 50%, man. Mm, lost those bunkers. You got it going for you. So, we got some kind of energy weapons. None of that. We're actually looking pretty good, but I don't understand why we would only make common energy weapons. Uh, let's go to three and really emphasize these guys because it takes so much more to make. Uh, scavenge power armor. Actually, what type of fleet do we have? We actually have a fleet! Now, in Overall Blues, I almost never use fleets because oh, they're not really that useful. Alexander Mahoney? Mahone? Not bad, actually. That's a... That's not, that's not bad, man. That's not bad. Hopefully, we don't go to war too early on. So, we already have one battle cruiser, one capital ship. That's not bad. Oh, triremes. Uh, let me double check this. I never remember this. Naval stuff. We get triremes, longboat hulls. Triremes and longboat hulls. So I'll grab goodbye. Triremes and long boat holes. Triremes, triremes. This one is a lower value. So bye bye. Long boat holes, long boat holes. This one is a lower value. Goodbye, goodbye. What we're gonna make are these, and then we're gonna make some of these. We're gonna do two, two. Very nice. Don't even want to look at them. They might be okay. They might not be okay. But it doesn't matter for now. Uh, actually, we're probably gonna war the Diablo Devils more quickly than anyone else. So we'll see what happens. Ah, collapse immunity. Forged in the catalyst of Ambos and Detrus, burned by nuclear Armageddon, the final battle of raw brutality and technological ignorance which sealed the world into a nightmare they wanted. While spare the nuclear obliteration, their souls became blistered by the fires of the hellish new world and tainted landscape they found themselves in. So, their new the Brotherhood was birthed, their roots firmly entrenched within the U.S. armed forces. In 2161, a new threat was discovered that which could sentence the crippled America back into the depths of destruction. The twisted abominations of the Master's army, with thanks to the Vault Dweller, had eliminated this threat in the Boneyard, storming Mariposa for the mall, ending the mutated threat once and for all. With the wise guidance of Rhombus, these subsequent years after the Master's reckoning were the chapter's greatest. The slow but steady reintroduction of technology into the hands of the rest of the world showed that humanity had ridded itself of its life immaturity, which originally destined itself to annihilation. His legacy was short of mastering the art of war. His legacy was that of scientific breakthrough. His legacy was that of mastering air navigation. Now, we could do Ohm's Law and Resistor, but you could, we, we can only get those done pretty darn quickly, so we're not going to do that. His legacy was that of mastering air navigation. That's not bad. Air technology might not be bad. I'm going to go with support research time, just because we're going to research all the things down there. So let's do Ignorance as Navarro. With victory came overconfidence in 2241. We face another great threat, but our ignorance cost us. Dearly. 
quite unfortunate right now. Uh, yeah, oh, still only 0.5 versus 1.1. Not great, but ignorance at Navarro actually minus 300 some. Let's go and buy some guns. If we can. Uh, well, we have 400. Hmm. Or oh, they need 500 stock. They don't even have 500 yet. If that's the case, let's go ahead and begin a scavenging program and disable this. So, ignorance. Over the years, the Brotherhood grew overzealous, drunk from the confidence in, of defeating the mutant threat and its status as a supreme power of advanced technology. Growing stagnant as a result, which would come at a terrible cost, the emergence of the pre-war federal or federal government of the U U USA, reformation into the Enclave, with the help of the Chosen One, the ancestor to the near-mythical figure, which helped in the eradication of the master, the Enclave was, were bested with the destruction of the capital, a large oil rig located off the coast of the Californian coastline. The Enclave forces regrouped in Navarro. With no averted threats or hostilities, they were left to fester and grow. In 2246, though, the Brotherhood sent a large force to contest the Enclave in Navarro, eradicating them for good, backed by volunteers from the Boneyard, the Hub, and the SSR. But this was def devastating defeat. Or devising defeat. They were unprepared, lacking, lacked planning, and were outmatched by the Enclave's technological superiority. The Brotherhood's inability to cooperate with other non-Brotherhood troops severely curtailed any chance at victory. It was an utter disaster. We must not let ourselves grow ignorant again. It was an utter disaster uh, defense. I, we're going to go... Mm, a lot of the places we're probably going to attack aren't even our core territory. Defending on core territory might be really good, though. So let's probably do that one. And Brotherhood infighting. With the defeat came isolation. We entrenched inwards. Our legacy and our ignorance fragmenting the Brotherhood. Infighting is probably not a good thing to have. And I'm just kind of waiting. Just kind of waiting so we can get a few more gunnerinos. Ah, with a defeat, rampant in the mind of the Brotherhood. They grew isolationist once more, retreating to the bunkers. Their legacy in the waste shrunk more and more every passing season. People forgot the Brotherhood in due time, but the Brotherhood did not forget. Forget the betrayal and the cataclysmic of defeat at Navarro. The Brotherhood did not stay dormant, however. The inner machinations of the organization were in constant flux. Heated debates rung throughout the chapter, of which or what the Brotherhood must do. The wastes grow more and more fragile every day. Without the Brotherhood, the wastes surely would fall back into anarchy. Over the course of these arguments, one group in particular grew to elapse all discussion and steer the Brotherhood into a new light, in which we can choose the Knights. Uh, this option will unlock the Knight Leadership Branch of your Focus Tree, or Council Supremacy, which will unlock the Council of Leadership Branch, or the Scribes, which will unlock that. So, we gotta talk about that immediately. Uh, actually, do... That's should the Brotherhood the Senior Knights. Oh, what is our conscription level? Paladins. Senior Knights gives you 2% uh, more recruitable population, less stability, and you get a little bit more attack and war support. But you get less special forces capacity multiplier. That is interesting. 15, 15, 10, and it goes down to 10. Huh. Okay. That's interesting. That's very that's a little different than what I'm used to. Okay. Interesting. We could do that, but mm, we could actually use the population right now. But attempt industrial recuperation. Uh procuring I want to just figure out the next one. Next land doctrine. Gateway to the Pacific Aerial Operations. We can wait on that. Alright, let's see. Power Armor Secrets. If we do that quickly. Uh, you know what? We'll just talk about it now. The question of leadership. This is what it's basically about. Uh, the leadership of the Brotherhood has been plagued with inefficiency and poor management as each segment battles to take control over the organization. Uh, we gotta talk about this. So, right now we can choose the Knight's Path, which we get more division speed and less supply consumption. We get Military Academy Officers, which basically means you go from local leaders and basically, don't you don't have to spend 400 political power to get all the way over here, which will cost you more political power. But you get more organization, starting level of the new army leaders, maximum command power increase, and just better leaders overall. Uh, you got that, but you get then you get outsider knights, which gets you more population and less stability, and you get steel battalions, so you get more recruitable population and more special forces of attack and defense. Or you can do council leadership, you get more planning. Uh, council scraps gives you more factory output. Council leadership gives you more attack and defense. Council hegemony gives you more planning and special forces capacity, which is not bad. You can do scribe leadership though, you get more research speed. You get cap and growth, more cap and growth. You get advanced energy weapons immediately, and an extra research slot. Well, we're already advanced. We already have five research slots. I think that's we're doing pretty well with that. We could do this one, but it's not bad. You get more special forces capacity multiplier and slightly more attack and defense, but if I don't have to spend 400 political power to get military academy training, we're gonna go with the knights, in which we get more special forces doctrine research time. Cool. Very good. Yeah, unfortunately, though, we only have only 92 manpower, and that also influenced my decision to go with steel battalions. So, question of leadership. I'm going to go ahead and immediately do this one. Maybe, maybe not. Mm. What if we did attempt industrial recuperation? With our toes dabbling in the precious waste again, or precarious waste again, we must group and collect, or recollect. Our first order of business should be to recuperate our industrial capacity. Sending scribes to recollect forgotten databases should remedy this. 
Let's see, we gotta go to well-equipped army, but probably finding the army first. Followers of the apocalypse, just let them in, I don't care. Uh, we need more war support to do that. Discourage traders. Uh, I'm kind of okay with that. Research advisor, military theorist, that would actually probably be pretty good to do. We do want to go down refined warfare, because we, we are using power armor. Scribe Perez, military quartermaster, not bad. Dis distinguished paladin, not bad either. And then scout Davies. Cool, hope they'll kill itself. General wait and see. I kind of like that. You get less planning speed, but you get more hardness. Veteran Paladin, not bad. And right now, we only have four. Uh, anything else here? Oh, we could buy some guns to do that. Sort of Diablo Canyon power plant. Alright, so let's look through here. I want to see if there's any way for, like, warfare, Diablo. Oh, the Devil's Skeleton. At least a thousand manpower in the field. Oh! So that's how you get the war goal against them quickly. I never knew that. So we can do Arming the Oppress, where we can release him as a puppet. Or the oppressors. A sizable force of Brotherhood of Steel troops will be sent to a civilian in the Diablo range. Prophets, cave complex. Arming the oppressed. That might actually fit very well for us, but... I don't know, man. I'm not really sure if I want to go down that path. Let's grab some military theorists first. You might as well. We could use that army XP immediately. So, the Art of Haggling, great. Attempt industrial recuperation. Great, 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 great. Lost those recovery. Maximum reconstruction. Well, I want to get some more civilian factories quickly. Doesn't really matter. Lost Souls Recovery. The bunker complex which safeguarded our forefathers have been left to rot for too long. Now that our unity is strong once more, effort should be made to recover and furthermore reconstruct the metal halls and labyrinthian complex which shielded us from the waste. And I love these focuses. 30 days. Oh, so nice. So nice. We get paid pretty soon. We got construction basics done. Great. Let's go and grab some uh, woodworking. That's always good to do. Let's grab some organized agriculture and we shall next do some reference manuals. And then maybe begin researching some of our land auction. That'd be very good. But we only get five people a month. Not that much at all. Hmm. Are Brotherhood members allowed to have families? I, I want to say yes. I don't, I don't remember exactly. Do they? Are they? Are they allowed? All I know right now is that with the followers of the Apocalypse, we're losing a lot of war support, which really sucks. Really not bueno. So we're doing better on power armor. We're doing actually better. We'll do fine on guns. I'm not worried about that at all. Lost sales recovery, great. Let's do surface complexes. Having an industrial pool to surge into various construction efforts, the Brotherhood sorely needs in times of such as these. Surface complexes come with the added benefit of freeing up space which might otherwise be tight on space, like our underground bunkers and outposts. We'll get a whole two factories. After this, I think we'll probably grab a little bit more uh, population if possible, because that would probably be pretty good to get. Let's go and grab some seed selection. I said we would get uh, land auction. We'll do secret language first, and then we'll do the land auction. Look at that. Already at two. Nice. And we're getting so much naval XP. That's so nice. Can we actually make better ships already? Going to do that first. Reclamation Authority. Great. We can spend our caps getting more stuff. I'll uh, do that then. Followers establish themselves. I don't really care. Good luck with that. This is not looking too bad, actually. It, these are usually never too bad looking at them. I think they'll, they'll be fine. I don't really want to edit them or anything like that. So do that if you can. Great, great, great. Any spare ships yet? No, we do not. And that's okay. Uh, consumer goods. Ooh, we could use a little more stability. I kind of like that. You know what? Grab more stability. I'm I'm all for stability. The more stability, the better. How much manpower do we have in the field right now? We currently have 875 guys. Well, with that's not too bad. Especially if we can expand the infantry and the... Actually, how big are the infantry divisions? Brotherhood Knights? To end combat with, that's not bad. That's actually not too bad. It's better than, like, two. <laughs> Much better than two. Sending mana prospectors, you might as well. And improvised tools. Great. Now let's go for our land auction. Not robotics yet, though. Work is needed. We'll grab some concentration of force. Very good. Very, very good. Next up, we're looking pretty good. Ooh, we could get, grab local workspaces, but let's grab some warrior training for slightly better division training time. And now we have surface complexes. Forging the steel. Even more arms workshops would be nice. Knight leadership. We could basically get some free population. So, knight leadership. It only takes 50 days. The knights have assumed overall command of the Brotherhood. Less supply consumption, which is great. More speed. And basically, some free manpower, which I love, 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 love. 0 0.012. And we're done recruiting more. It is what it is. Nice. That looks real good so far. Real good. Do even better on that. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Secret languages. Great. I love playing as a Brotherhood. That's okay. We're gonna... We could grab that. 130. Let's grab crowd control, because someday we will have a big ol' army that we need this stuff for. My words are difficult to use. Gliders! Oh, man. Imagine if we could get vertebrates. Or if we take over the Shi. Imagine if you could get um the Xi'an fighters. Those are so good, man. So good. Currently get 1.25 political power a day. That's not bad. 
Really not bad at all. Oh, how about Sodomancy? Yes, I love this. This is, this is almost broken, in my opinion. Like, if you do this enough times over the course of the game, you you can just have a massive industry. Now, instead of five people, 20% more means six. Diablo Devil Raid? Oh, no. Early today, there was a raid on one of our stockpiles. A group of raiders tried to steal our stockpile of military equipment in what seemed like a premeditated attack. While we chased them off, they did damage They did damage everything that they could not take, which was left nothing of significance. However, one of our industrial complexes was left badly damaged. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, we gotta get these guys out so we can go to war with them as fast as possible. How strong are these? They're not that weak, but they probably can't pierce our power armor. They have more divisions than us. Confirmed. Well, that's not bueno. Uh, you guys come over here. Why not? And you guys do that. There you go. Not bad. And I don't want to really hurt a gun amount. I want to get more soldiers in the field first. My leadership allow outside recruitment. The Brotherhood always needed more manpower. Many within the Brotherhood calls for allowing outside recruitment. While this may seem draconian, it would help massively replenishing the man pool, man pool the Brotherhood needs in times such as these. And we're going to need to do that so we can quickly get more manpower as fast as possible. Now, we shall come down here. I'm going to wait to go to war to get down here, because we'll go to war soon, probably enough. Soon enough. Yeah, we'll probably go to get that when we can go to war the Diablo Devils, maybe. Hopefully. We'll see what happens. Cultural Advisor. Ooh, that's not bad. Less consumer goods. More stability is not bad. Oh, political power gain. Ooh, that's not bad, too. Let's grab Knight Simmons for now, because currently we get 1.24, but now we get 1.45. That's 0.2 more. That's not bad, and that does help reduce the cost a little bit for when we change that, too. So, overall, I think that's a good choice. Uh, multi-purpose equipment. I love being able to research this stuff so quickly. Oh, it's so nice. Uh, night dominance, not bad. Division speed, less supply consumption, followers influence. Eh, it's okay. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Request. Oh, yeah, we could request aid. I suppose we could if we really wanted to. Medical technology, that's okay. Crowd control gear, yes, please. Oh, we already have all this stuff done. Nice. Scavenge PA. It's a little bit ahead of time right now. Grab some support equipment, though. That's always very useful. And more divisions, finally. Yes, if we don't mind. Yes, please. And that's why we're out of manpower. That's why I grabbed this other stuff earlier. Gliders, very, very nice. Go and grab some motorized flight. Gliders are so good to have. Love, love, love the gliders. Get you to the top, and get you closer to the bottom, I suppose, for now. That would be fine with me. At least make a little bit of fighters. This guy just found something. Hey! Overall political guide. More political power gain. Less subversive activities cost. Uh, we get slightly more political power. 1.56. Not a whole great deal amount, but also I'll gladly take it. Cool. Multipurpose equipment. Great. People are killing each other across the wasteland, and that's fine with us. We like it like it like that. Mm, let's just grab local workspaces next. We could get more output. We could really use that for now. Let's see. How much manpower do we have in the field now since we got those other divisions? We have a total of... 1.12 thousand. Nice. So once we're done with this, we're just going to go ahead and do this. The threats to the Brotherhood, and then we'll do the Devils of California. The Brotherhood may face as many threats, but those who wish to undermine the efforts of the chapter, we must be ready to face them. Good. So we automatically just get Senior Knights for, for free. Instead of 127 cost, it's for free. With After you wait like two months. Alright, I guess it's just one month. One month. So nice! So nice, you gotta love uh, Sweet Home California submod for Old World Blues. You gotta love it. Sometimes. Let's go actually get some more water, because we we're actually out of water, so... Before anyone tells me, Mr. Mocha Lover, you're out of water. I know. I know we are. It's unfortunate. Go ahead and train if you need it. Do we have enough guns for now? Yes, we do. We still need more power ar armor. But that sounds like a thing I'm going to say the entire campaign, but that's okay. Scavengers, vehicles, don't... For funsies, let's get some automation. More cap? Why not? Cap is nice. We're about to get paid soon, too, which is great. Spend political power, civilian factories. Mm, we could get some more stability. I am one who encourages more stability. A more stable nation. The rest of our brotherhood. And then we should do the Devils of California. Following their raid, many within the chapter clamor for a reaction, getting rid of them before they can deal any more damage to our chapter, and so ends our isolation. Not bad. Really not bad at all. Now, I could increase... Ooh, get some of the Boneyard. He wants to get close to us, offering technology. How should we respond? They remove four... What was that? Advanced components? Yeah, advanced components. And they give it to us instead. Do you like us? I guess I guess you kinda like us. The Shady Sands is trying to defeat the Scorpions right now. Good luck with that. Uh, but... Okay. Setting up manual prospects to see what we can find. I mean, I'm raring to go to war. I'm not gonna spend too much more... Uh, I wanna get more infantry equipment. That's why I'm not raising my 
uh, division levels yet or adding more battalions because we need more firearms and we can't buy any more right now i don't think yeah i need more caps so we're not gonna do that yet just because well we can't uh ship wise we could focus on ships a little bit but we're not going to right now specialized doctrines specialized warfare immediately do this one so we can make sure that our power armor is nice and muy bueno devils of california very very good Let's do some forging the steel. Why not? With our industrial capacity growing, now would be a better time than later to heavily invest into our military capability. We're renovating old buildings, establishing workshops in an industrial level. The Brotherhood is out of steel, and our steel will be tempered in places such as these. We got a whole three, three military arms workshops. That is nice. Concentration of force, that is good. Motorized flight, let's grab some rapid deployment for more, or I guess technically more training time, but more max speed for infantry. Those, they can move their chubby little legs a little faster than normal then. And we could grab some clay working. A little bit ahead of time, but that's fine with me. Especially as we're mobilizing, mobilizing, mobilizing mole. Very nice. Alright, so the ships should be done. Ready to do whatever needs to get done. And we're not going to go to war yet. How many divisions they have? They'll probably go and stop training for now. We have two, one, one, two. Oh man, this is not going to be a good war for us, maybe. Uh, I'm actually going to do this. You guys come over here. Because what we're going to do is we're going to attack here and try to do an encirclement, maybe. Uh, maybe here, up to there, or maybe he here, 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 here. Well, it's not going to look good, period, what we do, so. we got enough political power. Do we have enough guns? We do have enough guns. How close are the next divisions being made? Uh, you know, let's just go to war. If anything, we could probably defend okay, like, so. Oh, another, uh, oh, a battle cruiser. Not bad, not bad. You know what, for now... Just combine them all into one group here. There you go. Now they're probably going to attack us. Yes, they are, especially our infantry, which is not ideal. Uh, I was not planning on them attacking me here, but you know what? That's okay with me. Oh, the infantry is not doing very well over there, so we're going to uh, help them out. Hmm. Is there anyone I could spare over here? Not really. They break our lines a little bit, so be it. Whatever. My goal is to break their infantry divisions and make them lose the amount of resources that they have. Really put the hurt on them, because they're going to be shattering our line in the north, guys. You know what? Go ahead and deploy these guys, too. Uh, okay, then. That was definitely a decision I was not hoping you'd make, but that's okay. I think, oh, they're doing a last stand, too. And they're really trying to... You know what? Retreat. That's okay. Forge the steel. And now, dealing with the hub, local stuff. Maxim Reconstruction. We should also not forget our service holdings. Maxim is one of the prime above-ground locations, connecting the Brotherhood to the Pacific, as well as connecting us to top side. Extensive reconstruction efforts should take place, and Maxim should stand firm. And that happens within how, how many days? 30 days? We do massive reconstruction efforts in 30 days. Beautiful. Oh, we'll do every cap for the army. Who's, who's about well equipped army? Every cap for the army, then. Beautiful. Nice. Do what you must. Do what you must to encircle and destroy. Yeah, they are literally just going to die here, so I'm actually okay with that. Hot springs. That's fine. Yeah, I mean, the infantry obviously are not super, super strong. It is what it is. Basic tools, you might as well grab that. You don't have enough cats to grab more stuff, though, yeah. Because they're focused extremely harshly on destroying our infantry while I'm focusing extremely harshly on destroying, well, everything else of them. We can't allow, there we go. Nice. Beautiful, we have the first division encircled. Scavenger's gone something. Naval Doctrine, which I actually might be able to use in this campaign. War Propaganda, uh, sure, that seems like a pretty good idea. Season Patriotism, nah, we good. Uh, West Stability, not really worth it in my opinion. Uh, anything else we could spend political power, not really, that's okay. First division is gone. Now our loss is probably pretty high. Oh, 165 isn't bad. We don't have enough guns up for ourselves right now. Kind of unfortunate. Kind of unfortunate, but whatever. Good. Get in there quickly. Because even though I'm I'm ignoring this section up, up there, it's fine. It'll be fine. Scrap bots. Uh, plane stuff. Basic biplane fighters. Why not? Oh. Don't mind if we do. Another division, thank you. Now at this point, I'm not going to make any... Uh, I still want to make those. I'm not going to make any more division for those guys, just because we want to make sure that we have at least 20 combat with power armor divisions. 
Uh, resource scavenging, we can do that. Reinvest in our industry. Or renovating our industry. Our industrial capacity is still up, or stoops to an all-time low, following our regression into the bunkers. Now that we are out, much of our previous top side industrial facilities have been left to rot. Much of the technology recovered, thankfully. Now time's to put these structures back into working order. Alright, let's get rid of these guys. These bunch of degenerates. No, we're not playing as a legion. Oh, they still might deserve the cross, though. You never know. Well, they did raid us earlier, so we gotta teach them a lesson. I'm gonna actually have you guys go this way because it looks like they're breaking us just here, just a little bit. Yeah, they're doing. They're definitely doing a last stand. Look at the strength. Oh, they must have lots of maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Okay, so they def definitely have more divisions than us, but you know what? We still haven't lost nearly as many as they have, which is a beautiful thing, my friends. Beautiful. Southern Lucia Range. They're too strong there. It seems like they need to get pushed back. Begin assaulting, and begin assaulting. Infantry, you must have a rolling. Well, I want to say rolling stop, but. Rolling defense. Well, it's definitely giving us a lot more army XP. Four divisions? Hmm. We'll see about that. How much manpower actually do they have? You raid us. We beat you into submission. Specialized warfare? Great. Heavy troop mountaineering tactics. Immediately, because California has some mountains. At least that's what I've heard. I don't actually live in California. Been there once, but only in San Diego. I think. Oh, 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 what a shame. They went that way. What a shame. What a shame. Hey, look, another light cruiser. Nice. As long as they don't naval invade us, we'll be okay. Keep going, guys. We're innovating our industry. How about foundries of steel, though? Our military capacity should not falter. It must not. A heavy priority should be uh, dedicating on the construction of new and bigger military factories. Or our might must grow. We cannot fall back into the pit of isolation. We must not. That's not bad. Super technology? Nah. 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 Anything else around here? Uh, veteran paladin. I love the hardness. I really do. Get, don't get me wrong. And get more defense, too. But more attack... 10% more. Hmm. Especially since we're at war now. Maybe you can just smash them a little harder. Or thrash them a little harder. Don't mind if we do. Play working? I love it. Let's go ahead and grab some plant cultivation. Even though I'm ignoring more research speed for right now. I know. I just want to casually get rid of, you know, two divisions here. But a song from the front. Brotherhood forces have fought heroically against our enemies. And one of our soldiers has composed a little poem from the front. We can play this throughout our nation to rally the nation to the cause. We'll make sure everyone listens, because political power is nice, but war support is also very nice as well. Go ahead and demolish these guys if you can. That'd be great. Um, good. And you know what? You can help out as well. Very delightful, my friends. Very delightful. Don't let them move. They don't need movement where they're going. Uh, you move instead. There you go. They attack power armor. I'm not sure if that was a small call, man. A small call? A smart call. And they're gonna go bye-bye. As they should. Now, I've killed off 2,000 other men. 2,300 divisions. Now they have almost... Almost as few numbers as we do. Now, next out, we'd probably go jute this way, but... Hmm... We'll see what happens. We're kind of at a bad position here. But I get paid soon, though. That's nice. I like getting paid. Men are prospectors, but I want to buy more guns. So we gotta save our money up. Save up those caps. Hmm. We could push up this way. Would it be a bad idea? I guess we could. Not bad. Not bad. Vault City. Clear one real. Great. I love it when they're violent with each other. Okay, so they have got to be getting close to 3,000 now. Rapid deployment. Great, great, great. Flexibility command. Uh, flexibility movement. More breakthrough. Just... I love it. Love it. You guys got this. Let's see. Foundries of Steel. Great. And, ooh, we got under, underground bunkers. Ooh, uh, accepting efforts. Dockyard construction. Military academy. We lose political power immediately, but you know what? Help us out a little bit. Steel battalions. Special forces attack and defense plus 15%. I can't pass that up. The brother of the steel has at, at, has at its disposal an immense technological gain. Oh, yeah. Now that's nice. Now, actually, shifting over is kind of nice here. We gotta attack this area next. It looks like they're starting to run out of equipment or manpower or both, so that's good, pretty good for us. Grab some flexible designs. I just lied. Nope. We're grabbing resistors. Oh, yeah. Guns, 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 guns. Uh, so, we'll attack here probably next, maybe? 
mean, these guys aren't very strong. I really shouldn't be sending infantry to do this job, but whatever. Actually, I can send you guys this way then. And you guys can attack that way too. Now, power armor support right there. That's nice. Yeah, they're probably not too strong. We're not too strong either, but infantry versus infantry. Eh, it's kind of okay. What other upgrades can we get? Protection policies. Just go Freeman fixers. That's pretty normal. Pretty easy to do. We'll get some. We'll get the one that gives us better power armor support too. Nice. Very nice. If anything, I'm gonna actually tell you two to go right there. But really, only you're gonna go that way. In the meantime, you guys are gonna keep these guys stationary as best as you guys can. Obviously. Try planet. Yes. Yes. I have to. I love it too much. I love close air support. There you go. Nice. Very good. Now they're, they're getting attacked. You might want to help support the attack there. You might want to help attack there too. Just so this way we can have some sort of victory around here, maybe? Maybe not? Oh, we didn't quite encircle them, but that's okay. Go ahead. You know what, everyone? I wonder if we can do a pretty good job doing this. Infantry is doing okay. Power armor. Hmm. They really don't have an option. This one isn't. Infantry, yeah, definitely doing okay. Uh, best we made an encirclement. Can you actually go this way? You might be able to. If anything, go this way, guys, and go there. Plant cultivation, nice, very nice. Uh, anything else? Eh, flexible designs, because we can. And we got encircled. Oh, okay, that was a bad idea. You guys go that way. Yeah, we'll, we'll liberate these guys. We'll get them back. I'm not too worried about that. Heavy mount trooper mountaineering tactics. Heavy trooper close quarter tactics. That'd be good as well. Got a little bit of resistance, so be it. Steel battalions, and we freed them. Great. Uh, military academy. We might as well do that. So, opening a military academy to train new and fresh recruits experienced in the art of warfare and tactics will undoubtedly improve the Brotherhood. Alright, so let's stop these kind of pointless attacks. That was kind of a bad idea on my part. That was a bad idea. I thought we might be able to do a little better than that, but obviously not. How much more manpower does this nation have? They should have, like, none. Honestly, they have none. And I was correct. Very, very much correct. Don't attack yet. I, I just said don't attack. Very good. Uh, we need more guns, but when are we going to get those guns? Come on. Give me the guns. We need the guns. Because right now, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade the knights. This is going to cost us for quite a while. Because of all this army XP. Good. Uh, we could have you do stuff. Let everyone recuperate first. Have a good time. Mm-hmm. We definitely want to attack this way, maybe. Maybe. If we could get up there. It might be a little difficult, though. Reservation to clear one. You out. You're still trying to fight that group, huh? Well, they're fighting. You help out. And they're fighting. You help out as well. Smash your living crud out of them. Anyone getting upgrades? He's becoming a Hills Fighter. Uh, hills Fighter and a Hills Fighter. I like Hills Fighters. Help them out. Push them back even further. That'd be okay with me for now. Good. Next up, you're getting attacked. What we're going to do is this. You can't go there. So you're going to go that way. But you're actually going to go that way. Three divisions are going to help attack that way too. And two divisions are going to help attack at the same time. And you're going to do this. Force the attack. Crush every single one of them under your foot. If you can. If you can. Resistors. I love resistors. Let's grab some reinforcement with smoke signals. Anything else? No. We're going to focus on taking out at least one division here first. Good. Military Academy training is always nice. Reimburse the armaments. With our presence presence known, our armament industry should not wa waver. BDIs and technologically savvy raiders look onwards to pry technology from our grasp. We cannot let this happen at all. Oh. Fall of Vault City? Well, okay. Please do not get encircled in the meantime. You don't need two divisions going that way. Have one go there. Go and we'll have one go there. Hold them in place for now. I don't want them to move. That wouldn't be very nice. And go and help out support the attack. Actually, you know what? Are they moving that way? That's kind of okay. Good. Good, good, good. Building sabotaged. So be it. Oh, get one of these. Cool. Uh, yeah, resource efficiency gain. Dedicated equipment. Why not? At the same time, consumer goods. Why not? More stability for the nation. You find enemies, you beat them up. And you grab expert health fighter at the same time. More guns, please. More guns. And more manpower, actually. That's not looking good. So is the conscription level. Hmm. Now, we tried an attack. Could we actually win? Well, looks like we already completed the orders, so... Ba-ba. 
How much more do we have to kill? We're halfway done to capitulating them. Not bad. Come on, come on. Three, two. Try it again. The infantry is not trying anything. Hmm. Power armor? Well, the power armor is actually doing really well. Go ahead and go to North Lucia range. You might actually be able to just capitulate them if you do that. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see what happens. Caps. Definitely need more caps. Military society. Nah. Nah. Yeah, this stuff, not really worth it. Not really worth it. How about the cinnamon soap? That's always worth it. And maybe grab some more water in the meantime. Try playing attackers. Very nice. Uh, lightly metals. Uh, that's okay. Land doctrine we're doing okay on. Let's grab some special forces expansion already. Okay, well, we have taken the capital. There they go. And we're going to end the first episode there. Hope you enjoyed the first episode, guys, of us playing as the Western Brotherhood of Steel in Sweet Home California. If you did enjoy it, though, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow. As we will push further and conquer all of California under the Brotherhood banner. Thanks for watching, though, and have a great rest of your day.